Hey, what's up you guys? Shardens Prime here again, talking about a figure that I've already reviewed, but now I have a brand new copy for my own collection. I want to give a big thanks to Hasbro, and I am so stoked to have this once again. I was so sad to send it back, and now I have one in the actual box over here. And then to my surprise, Hasbro actually did not bring this figure with them for their display at the Hasbro booth. And just because I was stoked to have it, I brought this with me to San Diego Comic-Con. So if you wanted to check out the figure and you're probably down to use some hand sanitizer first, well, hey, I'll let you guys fool around with the figure. I will be at the Hasbro booth at around 4.30 p.m. because I have an interview over there. So yeah, if you guys wanted to check out the figure, I'll be with it. Spidey could be there waiting for you. I pre-ordered this via online retailer anyways, so uh, I'll probably get my bot copy uh, coming in the mail, and we'll see again there. So anyway, I'm looking at the boxes. You're watching it rotate over here, and on the top, you get that 60 Amazing Years logo and not much more at the bottom. So let's go ahead and watch me open this thing. I thought it'd be worth demonstrating how this would come out. And you have the wax paper in there and the cardboard in there. And it's, it's all there, man. What else can I say? I, I, I've seen other people actually get some figures with shoddy paint apps. Um, I weep for it's Dan who uh, I do because I think he had two of them that, that he had bad luck, but so far, uh, this one and my two basic figures, uh, Thor figures that I brought, bought for my kids, those had closed packaging too, so those ended up being fine. May have had another Marvel Legend figure with a closed box, I'm not sure, but uh, this figure looks A-OK -okay to me, and it has all the accessories in there, so I can't complain. Especially because the price was right, do you know what I'm saying? But hey, like I said, I, I want to get two of these. I I'm totally buying one still, gotta. You know, I, I just want more than one. All right, I love my Spider-Mans. Anyway, uh, let's get on to looking at some photos over here. So yeah, uh, at this very moment in time, while I'm recording this, I haven't taken any photos yet, so I don't know exactly how these pictures are going to look like. They may suck. They may be awesome. But I will tell you this, man. Uh, when I reviewed the figure the first time, I had a couple of friends that, that told me, like, hey, man, you know what? Uh, out of all the pictures you've taken, those aren't the very best pictures you've ever taken. And I'm like, oh, man, screw ah, You know what? You're right. So uh, I felt a little bummed out, and I was like, you know what? And at the time, I was very lucky to get the figure to review, but on a personal level... I had some personal stuff going on in my life and I'm not using it as an excuse to post, you know, crappy pictures, but I tried my best as much as it didn't look like it. And that's all I'm trying to get at. And I don't think my best was really that great. Uh, I wish it was better. So, Hey, I have an opportunity here to show off what I think are better photos, which I had done earlier before, you know, I'd, I'd showed the pictures, you know, uh, done with different lighting and everything. So, uh, anyway, yeah. Uh, the figure itself still looks great. I still have the same complaints that I did before about it, so I don't really have anything new to say about the figure. That's why this is not a video. It's just more of like a photo gallery video. I don't know exactly what I'm going to title it yet, but yeah, I'm enjoying the figure all over again. I love the pinless joints, and I feel like the cobweb pattern does look very clean. I still wish that it was sculpted instead of just painted on there. And uh, I'm still very frustrated with the web wings. Like the web wings, I'm I, I'm just having more fun not using them than using them. So you may see more photos of no web wings than me posing the figure around, fi posing it around with web wings. I just found them to be very irritating, and I can't wait until what other people say about that because so far it's, I just look hella ungrateful complaining about the figure at all. But I still think the one book got to review is the very best one, and I'm not jealous at all i'm happy for book it's not like that i just think that that's genuinely the better figure that spinneret two-pack spidey is gonna be the best spider-man marvel legends figure of all time and i can't wait to get it you know i just want one you know but eventually uh, people are getting their hands on it so i will get that spider-man one day sooner than later hopefully i find one at san diego comic-con uh but anyway recording this video before comic-con so expect a whole bunch of comic-con coverage if you haven't seen that up on the channel already again i don't know how many pictures i'm taking i don't know how how long this video is supposed to be exactly but you know i thought it would be a fun video to show off another copy of this spider-man figure and uh yeah hope you enjoy this video hopefully me rambling on and on is is fun while looking at 
hopefully decent pictures. I'm not sure how they're going to turn out. Maybe they'll be overexposed. Maybe they won't. I hope they look pretty good. Let me know. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and making opportunities like this possible because I never forget that this is all happening because of you guys. So thank you so much. Thank you Hasbro for being, I think, very cool. Uh, just having opportunities like this available for a whole plethora of youtube reviewers that love this hobby so i think it's cool stuff and uh stay tuned for more on the channel if you haven't hit that uh subscribe like and notification bell stuff please go ahead and do so and if i don't see you at comic con well i'll catch you later peace Hey, I'm sure I'm Prime videos. Hey, you should click one. Yeah, click on one of them. Or subscribe if you haven't.